Hey guys, how are y'all doing? My name is Nate, and today I'm here with a video that's a little bit different from what I normally do. What I'm going to be doing is to be talking about the detonator for Pyro, and why I've been playing Pyro a whole lot more recently. Now the biggest reason I've been playing Pyro is because he has so many different and interesting weapons to use, that just make him completely different to play whenever you use those weapons. Like for the Backburner for example, instead of just running at people with my Degreaser or Flamethrower and just laying them on fire, I have to make sure to be sneaky and get behind them. If I'm actually like careful and use it the correct way it's supposed to be used, it can actually be really useful in every situation. And more specifically what I'm going to be talking about today is the Detonator. Well, for those of you who don't know what this is, this is a secondary weapon for Pyro that I absolutely 100% fell in love with when I picked it up. Now for those of you who don't know, the Detonator, kind of like the Flare Gun, shoots and is able to light people on fire and do damage. But the thing that makes it unique and different is that you can actually jump up into the air, kind of like you can with a normal rocket jump. They won't go as high, of course, but all you have to do is look down at the ground and jump, crouch, and shoot, and you can fly high up into the air and actually do a lot of jumps that are actually really useful in a lot of situations. Now, I absolutely love this weapon for a number of reasons, and one of them being I can sneak behind people, and like here in this example, I can jump up into that little area and I can sneak behind people when they least expect it, and it makes it actually really useful to use. And second, I just love jumping in general. Just jumping with like any old class and you know, like, maybe like sentry jumping or double jumping, it's just so much fun to fly around the map and just get to different places you normally couldn't. And third, the weapon is actually really useful to use. Like, you know with like lots of gimmicky weapons that are just kind of like silly and it's like, oh, I'll just use it for fun because it's kind of fun and silly and whatever. It's not super serious. But this weapon is actually fun to use and you can use it in a lot of situations. Like, whether it's competitive or, you know, just normal online games, it can actually be really useful and you can get behind people and just jump up into these different places and it's a lot of fun to use. So what I'm doing here in the background is I'm just kind of showing you these different jumps that I figured out while I was using the detonator. And they're actually really useful. I mean, you can use these in any game. They, you don't take a ton of damage or anything. Out of all the secondary weapons the Pyro has, I wouldn't say it's the most, you know, practical to use in every situation. Because it, although you can, like, get to places by jumping and it's actually really fun to use too, you can't use the detonator in every single map and be super useful with it. Because not every single map is going to have a ton of places you can jump to and get behind people. It just kind of depends on the map, and kind of depends how you use it. Now compared to the flare gun, it does about 40 to 35 damage if you hit someone while they're on fire. So obviously it won't do as much damage, but being able to jump around is still really incredibly useful. So this kind of depends like what you want to use, like in what situation. I'd say in most situations you're going to be using the flare gun and the shotgun. But if you want to use the detonator, and like depending on like where it is on the map and what map it is, it can actually be really useful and you can actually do a whole lot with it. Now when you use the detonator, you need to make sure to rely on your primary and your melee weapon the most, because that's going to be doing the most damage. So what I would suggest if you're going to use the detonator, is to use the back burner along with it, because you're already going to be sneaking behind people anyways, so you might as well get the damage when you get behind them and get all those crits. Your melee weapon, I would suggest using the power jack, because it can give you a little bit more speed when you want to get to, you know, slightly farther jumps. Plus it can give you a ton of health that you've lost from, you know, detonator jumping and all that. So I'll just say, kind of, you know, try the weapon out for yourself, and see if you like it or not. Now is the weapon gimmicky? I wouldn't really say that. I would say the weapon is still very good, and that's, like, the main reason why I love it. Because you can actually use it in a lot of situations, it's completely different from just playing normal pyro, and it's a lot of fun to use. So I kind of like to compare it to the Mark Gardner a little bit. If you actually use it correctly, and you can, you know, get to different places, then it can be really useful. Kind of like the Mark Gardner. It's like, oh, if you can use the Mark Gardner correctly, you can actually kill a lot of people, and it's super useful. Plus, what I love about it is just being sneaky and getting behind people. You know, kind of like a spy. Playing spy is kind of fun because you get to be behind people and you need to sneak around them. Plus, and just in general, when you play Pyro, you need to stay out of the sight of people so you can sneak up onto them and just shoot fire in their face. You know, that's pretty much what you're doing as a Pyro. So I'll just say, just try it out for yourself. Like, I'm not going to force you to love this weapon, of course. You may love the flare gun, you may love the shotgun more. I mean, whatever, that's fine. I would just say, try it out, though. Maybe you'll actually enjoy it. Maybe it can be a whole lot of fun to use for you. I don't know. It just kind of depends, like what you like, and how you play Pyro, and what kind of weapons you use. Anyways, I just really love playing Pyro. Like, just kind of like all the other classes, just jumping around, having a fun old time. It's just a lot of fun. Well, like I said before, it's probably not the most practical weapon used in every single situation, but it's still a ton of fun. And really, if you get the hang of using this weapon, you can do very good with it. Like, I've seen some very good Pyros who can use the detonator to just like jump around and get behind people really quickly. Like, one example I know is a guy named Skechek, who can, you know, do crazy, insane tricks with the detonator and still get behind people and be really useful with it. And that's just what he likes to do. 
So I'll just say try it out for yourself. Maybe you'll like it, maybe you'll hate it. Either way, just try it out. And maybe you'll enjoy it, who knows. Anyways, it's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I know it's kind of different from what I normally do. You know, like rocket jumping and all that. But I, like, I don't know, I've just really enjoyed using the detonator, and it's a lot of fun. I wouldn't say it's like completely underrated, but I haven't seen it used by many people a whole lot. So maybe you'll enjoy it. Just try it out. I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, it's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.